With almost 26 days gone since the ascendancy of President Michael Sata, the ruling patriotic front has been racing against time in meeting their 90-day pledge of transforming Zambia. The education sector has become the latest sector to witness the prevailing transformation. The government has reversed the education system at basic and high school level to the old mode of primary and secondary school system. This is because the ruling party is concerned with the quality and relevance of education in the country as it has failed to inspire many Zambians to attend the best level of education. Minister of Education, Science and Vocational Training, Dr. John Perry, disclosed the changes at a news conference in Lusaka. Another failure to implement planned reforms was in the area of teacher training. There was no deliberate effort to train teachers who would teach from grades 1 to 9, as colleges were not transformed to meet this challenge, but have continued training teachers separately for grades 1 to 7 and grades 8 to 9. Whilst the universities train teachers for grades 8 to 12, on the other hand, in all these training programs, teacher output has still not made teacher demands at all educational levels. The PF government cannot allow this situation to continue where the meager resources of the country are not being used prudently and access to quality education is a preserve of the elite who are able to send their children to any school of their choice. The basic and high school system is said to have contributed to the poor performance in the education sector, which includes lack of commitment and transforms that did not match with adequate preparations, financial, material and human resource. The new government is optimistic of prudent utilization of resources in the sector. Delfista Lungu, Movie TV News in Lusaka.